What's going on, pop lovers and collectors? I'm back with another video. <sighs> this one's exciting. They're all exciting, to be honest. But uh, this one is... Well, I don't even know what to call it. I've watched the first two episodes of the show. It's a television series. Animated television series. And my God jaw to the floor jaw to the floor it was intense especially that very first episode and uh yeah i i just couldn't believe it and the voice actors in this cartoon i'm not really big on the, on cartoons anymore you know i used to watch family guy i grew up on the simpsons well i was an adult when the simpsons came out but uh yeah but uh, this is the amazon exclusive and it's invincible. The TV series and the pop. Look at him. Son of Omni Man just gets his powers. Whoops, I shouldn't be. Spoiler alert! Sorry, guys. I didn't think. Uh, yeah, I, I, I've only watched the two shows because I've been really busy lately. My God. My gosh. Look at him. Look at him. He's beautiful. He's bloody, bloody beautiful, my. My. Look at him. Looks exactly like him. Phenomenal. Just phenomenal. And it's Stephen Yuen, I think his name is. Stephen Yuen, uh Glenn from The Walking Dead, doing his voice acting. Really cool, really, really cool. It kind of reminded me of uh, just just into the Spider Verse, you know, just just the feel of it, except a lot more violent. I'll tell you that this show is not for kids. <laughs> it's, it's just not for kids. No sir, no way, no how. I'm just trying to stand it up so you guys can still see it. All right, there's one. Okay, so this was $14.99. Here's $1,500. Omni Man. This is, these are both the regular versions. There are bloody versions. Stay tuned, stay tuned. But Omni Man, yeah, it's a... Uh, What's funny, I found funny, and the first thing I noticed is when I heard the voice actor, uh, J.K. Simmons, who is also, uh, God, his name's escaping me, J. Jonah Jameson in the MCU. So it's just ironic that he looks like J. Jonah Jameson in the show, except for the flat top. It's the same actor, and they look the same. It, it, it was just, it was, it was just cool. The first thing I noticed, my son uh, T Bone put me onto the show. Kept telling me, "Yo, you gotta watch it. You gotta watch it." So I watched it. I pre-ordered these pops because, well, he, he was kind of, he was kind of hype on it. So I, when I watched that first episode, and anybody who's watched the first episode knows, knows what I'm talking about. The end of that first episode was just like, I don't know, I don't know, but he is super, super cool. And on the stand with the uh, the flowing cape, look at him, he got his gray hair. Tell me it doesn't look like J. Jonah Jameson. I wish I had the J. Jonah Jameson pop to compare his outfit. The flowing of the cape. Just a beautiful pop, beautiful pop. Yeah, and even though it's a it's an animated show, this show, like I said before, is not for children. I'm talking about young kids. It's not gonna. <laughs> you're gonna leave the room and leave the kid there watching it, and then you're gonna start hearing some stuff, and you're gonna go, 
What am I letting him watch? So, that's Omni Man. Now, 1501, Enemy! The girlfriend, but not girlfriend. Yeah. She's pretty cool. They're, they're, they're all cool. The show is cool. The show is cool. I just got to find time to finish watching it. So she's well done as well. Well done as well. It just didn't sound right. We're going to crack this baby open and see what she has to offer. Another one on a stand. I'll show this to you quickly. She's got her little power forming in her hand. Just on the stand, just sort of elevated is just a beautiful, beautiful way of doing it. Beautiful way. And I like that it's attached so you don't have to freaking try to pull the stand out from underneath. Yep. That's it. That is Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve, the love interest. I'm giving away too much, but these are all, these are all love. Uh, So, there's a fourth. There's actually a f two more, but I haven't gotten them yet. So, this last one is a Funko Specialty Series Exclusive, and it's Invincible. Bloody. And look at... I, I, I'm really upset about this. I have to call it uh, GameStop customer service because this is a pre-order. This isn't order. This isn't like shit. Okay. You got the tear in the back. You've got uh, where is it? Down here. I don't know if you can see. It's kind of rough. Yeah. And I tried to call other stores and stuff like that to uh, see if anybody has that they say they have it, but everyone's like, no, no, no. Ours are all damaged, too. So I got to call customer service Monday morning. And here he is all bloody. Bloody buddy. And damaged. You can see, you can act. It's pretty cool because on his right eye, if you're facing him, you can see the battle damage. The battle damage to the face. Incroyable, incroyable, mon ami. Okie dokie. Well, so that's it for Invincible. Beautiful, beautiful set of pops. I'm glad I got them. Uh, they're pretty in high demand from what I saw. So, anyways, guys, that's your video of the day. Like I said, I'm going to try to do this a lot more often. A lot more often. So, tune in. If you like the video, consider hitting that like button and subscribing and turning on the notification so you never miss an episode. Never, never, never. Uh, also, interested in video games, especially retro arcade games. I specialize in it. Launchers, retro arcade here on YouTube. Link in the description. Hope to see you next time. Take care and enjoy your pop hunting.